Apple hosted its California streaming event late last night where it introduced a number of new gadgets the iPhone 13 series, new iPad, iPad mini, Apple Watch 7 series, no not AirPods 3. Well in this video we're gonna take you through every single gadget that Apple had announced last night. You're watching India Today Tech, I'm Manas Tiwari. The iPhone 13 series was the highlight of the event and the Pro models, iPhone 13 Pro and iPhone 13 Pro Max got the biggest upgrades with 120Hz displays and a new cinematic mode for recording videos. With exceptional materials like these surgical grade stainless steel bands. Each band goes through a physical vapor deposition process to create an Apple custom finish that is so elegant yet incredibly resistant to abrasion and corrosion iPhone 13 Pro comes in four striking finishes, a rich deep graphite, gorgeous gold, beautiful silver, and this all new Sierra Blue. iPhone 13 Pro has a newly designed front with a true depth camera system that's 20% smaller. On the back, you'll see our incredible new camera system with beautiful stainless steel trim that perfectly surrounds the sapphire crystal lenses of each of our three new cameras and a beautiful textured matte glass that feels great and shows off the stunning color. On the front, it has our incredible ceramic shield that is tougher than any smartphone glass. Now, let's talk about performance and the powerful new A15 Bionic. As you heard from Hope, A15 Bionic features a CPU with two new high-performance cores and four new high-efficiency cores and a faster neural engine, with our latest technology, this ProMotion display can refresh from as low as 10 hertz to as high as 120 hertz. This is really awesome when using our all new cinematic mode, which uses machine learning and disparity. The one terabyte joins our 128, 256, and 512 gigabyte storage options. iPhone 13 Pro still starts at 999, and iPhone 13 Pro Max still starts at 1099. We also had our first look at the iPhone 13 mini and iPhone 13 which also come with few upgrades in the camera department. It has the sleek flat edge design that people love. iPhone 13 has a new look for the advanced dual camera system with the lenses arranged diagonally. The aerospace grade aluminum frame is beautifully formed and really shows off five new colors. An all new pink, blue, midnight, starlight, and product red. On the front, the TrueDepth camera system has been re-engineered to provide more display area. It combines our powerful cameras, next generation image signal processor, and computational photography to create our most advanced dual camera system. This beautiful design is the same across two sizes, iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 mini. A15 is a powerhouse. With all this, iPhone 13 still starts at just $699. A lot of us predicted that Apple will launch Apple Watch Series 7 during the event, and it did. But unlike what the rumors and leaks suggested, it comes with a similar design as its predecessor. In fact, all the previous watch bands are also compatible with Apple Watch 7 series. It takes all the great features of Apple Watch and combines them with our largest and most advanced display ever. The new Retina display on Series 7 has nearly 20% more screen area than Series 6. Series 7 will be available in five new aluminum colors, midnight, starlight, green, blue, and product red. It will also be available in silver, graphite, and gold stainless steel, as well as natural and space black titanium and Series 7 is compatible with all existing bands. So that's Apple Watch Series 7. It has the largest and most advanced display ever, an optimized UI with new keyboard and watch faces, best ever durability, fast charging, new colors, and all the great features of Watch OS 8. And when you talk about the Apple events, of course you expect a lot of surprises. In fact, this event started with a big surprise and Apple introduced its new iPad for 2021 during the event as well. This new iPad is packed full of updates, so let's jump in. Under the hood is a more powerful chip, A13 Bionic. 
The upgraded image signal processor in A13 also means the rear camera captures great photos with improved autofocus in low light, with 20% faster performance in every aspect of the chip, from the CPU and GPU to the neural engine. A13 is leaps ahead of the competition. And this new iPad will ship with iPad OS 15, which is packed with great new features, because this new iPad starts at just 329. It won't be wrong to say mini is the new normal because Apple also introduced iPad mini and it looks like kind of cool. We're giving iPad mini a huge set of updates. The all new enclosure features a beautiful all screen design with narrow borders and elegant rounded corners. So this is the all new iPad mini featuring a brilliant liquid retina display, super fast performance, New cameras front and back, center stage, 5G, support for Apple Pencil, and all new colors. With its all new design and huge boost in performance, the new iPad mini starts at just $499, and it'll be available in both Wi-Fi and cellular configurations. So in total, Apple introduced four new devices last night, the iPhone 13 series, which itself has four new models, the iPad 2021, iPad mini and also Apple Watch 7 series. We have you covered throughout the day, we'll be putting out more videos around each of these gadgets. So please subscribe to Indirate Tech if you haven't. Also tap on the bell icon so whenever we put these videos, you get a notification. Thank you for watching.